Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for being here. Today I have a glossy box, surprise me box. And here's the thing, I am surprised. I came up to open my glossy box box and thought it was going to be my January box and it is a surprise me box. So I will put all of the information about this down below, but let's get into it and see what we've got. This glossy box was sent to me free for review, but you will get my honest review and I, really enjoy glossy box. You guys know if you watch the channel, I have very sensitive skin and for some reason I have a lot of luck with the brands they send, not irritating my super sensitive skin. One of the beauties of being a glossy box subscriber and I will put all of that information below with a code with a discount for this and to subscribe to glossy box. But one of the awesome things about subscribing to glossy box is that when these special boxes come out, you get them at a discount, usually five to $10 off, usually about $5 off, but they're always fun. And look, they did this one so that it's just like the Advent box. It opens just like the Advent box does, and then it's magnetized. So cute. So back to where we were. When we open it up, inside we have our paperwork, just like we always do, and it is wrapped up with a little ribbon, looking pretty. It's always such a really pretty package. So let's see what it is. I have absolutely no idea. It's a surprise box to me. When we open, ooh, this looks fun. When we open it up, that's what it looks like on the inside. It looks like it is full of goodies. Again, I will put all of the pricing information. I'll put it here. I'll put it down below for you. I'll have it everywhere. And we have our paperwork. And this says Glossy Box Holiday Limited Edition. Unfortunately, I quit taping not too long right before Christmas. So if I didn't have the boxes by then, I haven't Hi, how are you? Happy New Year. I haven't taped in a little while, but I am back. We are going strong. We're going to introduce some new boxes. I can't wait to get this new year going. We have seven products on the inside that tells us about what all of them are. I just looked at the number, not what we have. So let's dive in. We have something from KGC. And that is what it looks like. I think I've had one of these before and it was an eyeshadow. So let's see what it is. There are little sequins in the bag. That is so cute. This is a loose shimmer powder. It is a multifunctional loose shimmer powder that's exactly what you need to add a little pop to your look. Whether you want to have a glittery eyeshadow, highlight your cheekbones, or add a little sparkle to your lips, this bold pigment can do it all. $15 and it says shop Kawaii Girls Cosmetics. So I suspect that's what the KGC is. Something in me wants to keep this cute little bag with these rhinestones in it and put something else in it for my granddaughters, but I'm pretty sure my daughter would have my head if I did that. <laughs> that is what it looks like out. It's just a cute little top with a little pink lid. When we open it, it is sealed. Oh, but that's it. Once you take the lid off, it is an open pot. That is what it looks like. I'm gonna snip it. You know, I usually go straight from there to, I don't think I want a nose full of this. It's a really loose, really fine powder. It's kind of fun shaking it around and watching it. It's like a snow globe. That is what it looks like. It's just like, I can't even feel it on my finger. It's so finely milled that I just can't feel it. Ooh, but it's glittery. Look at that. That could be so much fun. I don't think I would care for the feel of this on my lips. It does have a little bit of that glitter feel to it, but it is, that would be fun on your face. Or in the summer, across your clavicles, that would be so pretty. Oh, pull it through my hair, get a little bit of, I'm so happy to be back in taping. <laughs> that is pretty. Next out, we have Voce Viva Valentino Eau de Perfume Intense. And look, it looks like it's gonna be a really nice sized bottle. I don't have any perfume on yet, so we'll have to try it. Oh, I love this. I love the mini perfume bottles. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. I don't know if this will ever come across. But can you guys see the sides are indented to match the, that is so, Pretty, very pretty. I just love when you get perfume, like the flower bomb one, when it is the perfume bottle, but miniature. I have them set up downstairs. They are so pretty. This has a $9.45 value. If it were full sized, it would be $135. And it says it is the Voce Viva Eau de Parfum. This scent is an ode to Valentino's femininity, a harmony of couture, orange blossom, and golden gardenia. So I'm thinking it's gonna be floral, right? Is that what you're thinking? <laughs> Paired with colorful Italian bergamot and mandarin. Ooh. This fragrance is made addictive through an unexpected cool note of crystal moss and vanilla perfume. Let's get in here. That all, oh, so it's 
when you take it off, it's the plunger type. Oh, that is, wow, that is nice. Something about it even smells luxe. Oh, that is, that is gorgeous. I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. I know you guys probably hate it when I go on and on about perfumes. This, this may be my favorite that I have tried on. I can't even tell you how long. I don't compare it to like when I do my Lush box. You know, in my Lush kitchen that I got for December and January's came today, so I'll be taping that in the next day or two. I received Sultana. That is just a fun kind of gourmand, flirty fragrance that like if I'm going to the grocery store or something like that, I would put on this. It says I'm putting on my little black dress. It's just classy, a little sexy, not floral. In the beginning it said orange blossom and gardenia and I thought, oh, this is gonna be seriously floral. It's not. I don't know how. That is, that is incredible. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous scent. It absolutely makes me wanna buy the full size. I'm gonna be smelling that all day. I'm just so gorgeous. Next out, we have the Dutch Dirt Mask. I know right away I'm gonna set this aside. We did get this in another box and I can't use it. I was a little too sensitive for it. It is from Bloom Effects. That is what it looks like. It is full sized and the paperwork says from Bloom Effects, this Dutch Dirt Mask is an exfoliating scrub and face mask in one. This formula combines the best of chemical and physical exfoliation to create a skin purifying, pore purging powerhouse. Plant and fruit enzymes and floral acids teamed with Dutch peat, volcanic sand, and kaolin clay work to purify, detoxify, and renew dull and congested skin. And it has a $49 value, so wow. I really wish I could use that, but I have, and just know, I have, if you're new to the channel, I have super, super sensitive skin. Also, Happy New Year. If you're new to the channel, I hope you will consider subscribing. We'd love to have you around in the fam. And if you think you are subscribed, but by chance you clicked here through a link, how about making sure you're still subscribed? They did a big YouTube purge, unsubscribed. I got unsubscribed from people that I really like to watch. So I don't know why they do that every year at the first of the year, but they seem to do it. Next out, we have a Frederick Fakai shampoo. Is that a conditioner? Just the shampoo. We have the Frederick Fakai CBD scalp calming shampoo. That is what that looks like. I will not start the year with my same CBD rant. CBD, I guess I could maybe try it on my hair, but it irritates my face. I am not against CBD. I know a lot of you, we talked about this near the end of the year in one or two of my videos. I know a lot of you love CBD, totally get it. It's really, the hemp oil too, it's really supposedly good for your face. If you can use it, it seems to be something that irritates my face. And I was just saying, it seems like CBD is in everything these days. This implies I should have the hydrating mask. Yeah, I do not. So in theory, if you got this, you would also have the hydrating mask. And if you didn't, you would let them know and they would happily send you another one. I, before they started just, because this kind of seems important, before I started receiving these free for review, I belonged to Glossy Box. I probably got Glossy Box for a couple of years. It's just always been a box that I have enjoyed. And I did have one problem. I think I had a broken eyeshadow palette and I got really quick service and got a whole new palette in no time. So if this was a box you were subscribed to, they would happily send you out your missing conditioner. But the paperwork says the CBD scalp calming shampoo and hydrating mask is an amazing duo tailored for sensitive scalps and dry hair that are looking for clean, healthy glow. They help calm and soothe your scalp, hydrate your hair, and are proven safe on color and care and treated hair. They work together to bind moisture into the hair and dramatically reduce breakage. Wow, that is something I could definitely use. The deluxe sample set is a $16 value, and if it were a full-size set, it would be a $53 value. Let's see what it smells like. I'm just gonna take the lid off and give it a sniff. My husband will probably use it. it smells like Valentino. That's the only downside of doing that. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. That's the only downside is now everything smells like that Valentino. Okay, a little bit green. I'll do that. I don't know if you guys can see, it looks like it's just a cream color. Oh, was I spilling it? I looked on my video like I was spilling it. What's up? I came up with iced coffee. Maybe not the best idea because I'm already fairly. Yeah, 
It just smells a little green. I like it. I would absolutely use it on my hair. Okay, next out, I found rooting around for my mask, the Collagen Eye Patch by Lopcos. I love eye patches. I'll say it every time I get one. I prefer an eye patch to a full face mask. The full face masks, I can't do them in the winter because they're so darn cold. And I'm such a whiner when it comes to cold. But I will do eye masks. And I really appreciate the moisture around my eyes the absolute most. And the paperwork says that this is a nano gold lip repair mask and you got a full size one. So they must have had a sourcing issue and instead of getting a lip mask, we got an eye mask. And I will tell you that this says that it is a hydrogel eye patch with collagen extract that firms and smooths the delicate skin around the eyes. Just 10 to 15 minutes, move on with your life. Okay, next out. <laughs> This is polarizing. This is a very, very polarizing product. It is the By Terry, what is it called? It's a lip balm, but it's rose, right? Is this the rose one? It's not on here. What is happening? Is there more on the back? Nope. Guys, I don't know what to tell you. We're off the rails. It is, what do I think it's replacing? Let me see. I think we got everything else, so it must have been a bonus product. <gasps> Maybe they ran out of conditioners or couldn't get the conditioners, so they gave us this because it's not on here, but I have everything else that's on here. Okay, well, let me tell you what I know about this. I think it's called a balm. Yeah, balm de rose. It is a lip balm, and it is by Terry, and I like the by Terry products. I like almost everything by Terry does. This, I love Rose. I, we've talked about it on the channel. I know Rose is polarizing. It's kind of like cilantro. You love it or you hate it. There is not a lot of middle ground. I really like it. And I have actually finished one of these, but the last one I got, all of a sudden, yeah, it smells like Rose. I was getting right. See, it just smells so much like Rose. It does. And when you put it on your lips, it tastes like rose. And the first one, I went all the way through. And the second one, which was exactly the same as the first one, all of a sudden I was like, why does it taste like rose so much? I will probably use this because it is so good for your lips, but I really try and do it at night. So like I'm going straight to sleep. So the taste doesn't bother me. The scent doesn't bother me at all. I love the smell of roses. I don't know whether it's because it's floral or because it reminds me so much of my grandmother, but I like it. It's really good for your lips. It does taste like rose. Okay, next up, and I see it on the paperwork. So I know we're good. We have a Neolastin product. It's really pretty. It's in a nice little organza bag. That is what it looks like when we get it out. Let's see if it is full size. It looks like it might be. The, oh, nope, it's a deluxe size. This is worth $56. If it were the full size, it would be worth 140. And you know what? I think that probably works out mathematically because this is 20 mLs that they say is worth 56. And if it were full size, it would be 45 mLs worth 140. So I think that's probably almost exactly spot on. Rejuvenate and Hydrate Moisture Cream. Formulated with high quality ingredients and revolutionary technology, this moisturizer, suitable for all skin types, nourishes your skin with anti-aging, hydrating moisture that revitalizes and restores skin texture and gives it a more radiant look and feel. Since this is basically $60, in a sample and I'm not sure if I can use it. I'm just gonna show it to you guys again because I'll look up the ingredients and if I can't use it, I'll set it aside. And last but not least, is that true? Yes, last but not least, we have a Milk Makeup in Work. That is what it looks like. It's gonna be for lips or cheeks. I think I might have this color. I wish I would go downstairs and get it, but you know what? I'm probably gonna give this to my daughter so she won't mind if we swatch it. Let me take the top off. That is what it looks like. And that is a swatch. And I think it's a lip and cheek tint, but we will read about it in just a second. It is full size. It is a mini lip and cheek in work dusty rose. And it says this easy two in one dusty rose cream stick doubles as a hydrating sheer blush and lip tint and builds as you swipe its mango butter and avocado oil infused formula that hydrates and blends seamlessly into the skin and has a $20 value. And it's really nice. I mean, it's a great color for me. I like it a lot. It has a nice shine to it, but not so much that if you wanted a quick little cheek tint that you couldn't just, so it's very nice.
This box has a $177 value, and that is my estimate based on what I remember before. As I recall from past boxes, the by Terry lip balm, even in that size, was like $14, I think. So that's what I used, and I halved the cost of the shampoo and conditioner. We have the $56 Rejuvenate by Neolastin. We have the Bloom Effects Dirt Mask that is $49. So the $20 Milk, it adds up quickly. So let me know below what you guys think. This was their special box called Surprise Me, and that is what it looks like. I will put all of the links below. I'm sure you can just buy this box, but if you sign up for Glossy Box, all the extra cool boxes that they do, you can get at a reduced price. I just really enjoy Glossy Box. Like I said, it's something that before they started sending it to me for review, I had already gotten for a couple of years. I really like it. Thank you so much for coming by. I hope you are having a fantastic, wonderful, happy new year. Let's start this new year. Let's start it great. We've got to think of something new to add to the channel for the new year. I'm doing some new boxes. I have some new boxes coming, so that's fun. You know, it's been so long since I've taped. I could just sit up here and talk to you guys forever. So I will let you go. Thank you so much for coming by. If you were subscribed, please make sure you still are. YouTube went through and unsubscribed people from a lot of channels. I know I was unsubscribed from some that I watch on the regular. So if you are new, I hope you will consider subscribing. Please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you'll know when I have more videos coming out. And take care out there, guys. Thank you so much for being here.